Hi, my name is Phil from Festool UK. I'm down here with Axminster to Tools and Machinery in Devon. With the HKC55 and the FSK, it's a perfect combination for working with accurate cuts on construction materials at 90 degrees and also with angles. But, also, but with the HKC55, we can use this for other applications such as plunge cuts. So the first thing we need to do is to remove the HKC off the FSK rail. Take the saw forward, move the tab in, and then it can come away. So what we need to do first is to set the depth of the saw. And we can bring the green up to the grey tab, and then we can take the saw down, take it up to the distance or the depth of cut that we need. I've got FS written on here, so I know that I'm going to be working on the guide rail. The next stage is to hold the saw onto a firm surface. There's a small tab here, we can push down on here and the saw can be in the raised position. I've already marked out where I need to make the cut, so now the pendulum cover can be brought back. We can put this onto the FS guide rail and of course we want to make sure we, don't, we work without any risk of kickback and I can use the anti-kickback stop that fits onto the FS rail. Bring this forward into that position, lock it off, I can mark out exactly where I need to make the cut and now once the dust bag is on we can make the cut in exactly the correct position and in confidence that it's going to be accurate and straight because we're working with the guide rail system. So I hope this helps your understanding of working with the HKC 55 for this type of application. And don't forget any machine from Festool is available with service all inclusive and of course, it's also available from Axminster Tools and Machinery. Thank you for watching.